Welcome everyone, Farmer Cop here. This is going to be a guide to corn cob mix or CCM in Maze Plus. If this is what you're looking for, please stay tuned. All right, folks, welcome to uh, the last part so far, at least as far as I know, the last part of Maze Plus, uh, my tutorial series. If there's stuff you think I missed or should go over that I forgot about, uh, make sure you leave a comment down below so I can put out another video. But this is, as far as right now, my last planned one. So we're going to talk about corn cob mix, um, how to make it, what you can do with it. So um, a couple things to note. So we just have a grain cart here. We have a regular trailer here. But what is this red thing and what is this pallet of right here? So these are the two things. That says Luprasol on the pallet. So what is that? Uh, so we're going to talk about these things real quick. So first off, um, actually, yeah, we'll talk about these first. So if we go in the store under miscellaneous, you're going to find that red cart out there the ccm mill uh, it says it requires 120 horsepower we'll take corn and luprasol um can hold 13,000 liters of uh, i believe it's corn but anyhow you can adjust the tires if you want to but there you go um you do need this or you need some other mod this is built into uh maze plus i want to note that this is built into maze plus i can't say that enough this isn't a separate mod it's built into maze plus uh the ccm extension at least so it's built into that so if you have the CCM extension installed, um, this will be in there. Um, so you'll need that. Now another thing, if we go under pallets, um, this is optional. Uh, Luprasol here, you can buy it for $8,000 for a 2,000 liter tank. That seems pretty expensive. You don't go through it that fast. What this does is improves the overall yield of the process. So if you don't use it, you're not going to get as much, but you don't have to use it. Um, so I have it right there. We're going to run it with and without. So essentially, you're going to put corn into this hopper. It's going to come through the mill. And then this pipe, if I go... Uh, into the tractor i can put this pipe out and then it will mill it and there's no turning this on or anything like that matter of fact it's got my there we go but there's no turning this on it doesn't turn on once that pipe is open that's how it's on so um i will put that in and oh of course is how to turn that on enough there we go okay so first things first, you got to get corn in here. Now you can either pull a harvester over it. You can pull this under a silo and fill it up. Um, you can load it with a telehandler, wheel loader, something like that. Or I'm just going to do this. I have this thing with corn in it. And of course, I'm going to keep turning that on and off because O is the hot key for that. And that's how I put the pipe out. So I pull up here. Should allow me to put some corn in there which I'll actually leave that just like that. So that's gonna fill up with corn. Actually, I can probably go out of flight mode now that we're kind of done with that stuff. So that's got corn in it now. Now, if I go in here and I put the pipe out, actually it holds 12,000 liters of corn, 1,000 liters of lumina, or luprasol, sorry. You can see it's gonna start milling right away. So, and it's just gonna get filled up with corn. Now, if I get rid of that, I hit R to refill, it's gonna fill me up off of that pallet. So it took half of that pallet. Now, if I put the O out there again, and I get in this guy, it's going to, let's get a little bit closer so it makes a little bit more sense. It's going to mill it. So what it's doing is you're taking regular corn, which the corn you're going to grow like you grow any other corn. You are going to grow it, and you're going to harvest it with a, uh, a harvester, and you're going to harvest it using a corn header because you want to just get regular corn like we've had in the game before. And now you see down there at the bottom right hand corner, what we're getting after we're milling it is raw CCM or corn flour. So CCM stands for corn, corn cob mix, um, and that's what we're getting with it. So as we get corn flour, I will show you how what the next step is, is to ferment it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a load of it here uh, in this trailer, and I'll bring you guys back in when I'm set up and good to go as far as fermenting it goes. So this is how you get it. You get corn into the mill. And you can use Luprasol if you want to have a better yield out of it. And if you do use that, then it's going to go ahead and mill out to uh, corn flour or raw CCM. So that's how we get to the raw CCM. Now, the next part of this is going to go over how to get this to um, CCM fermented. All right. So as far as fermentation goes, there are a, there's a silo built onto this map near the pig farm on Charwell Farm, that is, um, that you can put it into the silo and it will ferment and come out as CCM um, instead of the raw CCM, which is what we have now. So it turns into CCM. Now what we can do as well is we can dump it into a uh, bunker silo like this one here. Let's put some in there and then we can just get it compacted real quick, which should not take hardly any time at all. There it is, already almost done. And there it is, done. So after it's completely compacted, you have raw CCM in here. I can hit R to cover it like any other bunker silo. Now if I speed up time, 
This is going to get fermented super quickly. As you can see up there, and then once this is fermented, it's going to turn into um, CCM. So that's what it's going to ferment into. And then we'll talk about what you can actually do with the CCM after it's fermented. Um, so, yep, yeah, there are other mods in the Mod Hub, but there should be other mods available um, where you can use the silo to ferment and do some different stuff like that. But essentially, this, so you can see it's, it's completely done now. Um, we'll go ahead and slow time back down and move us back into daylight hours so we can see what we're doing. So now we come up here, open it up, and there we go. We have CCM in there. So it's that kind of nice, uh, fine look to it. So you can see this is CCM raw. Now, if I fill this trailer up with uh, CCM that's fermented, you can see it kind of has that nice light color comparatively. So this is CCM. Now, what can we do with CCM? So if we look at our animals, uh, sheep, they're not going to take CCM, which makes sense. Here's where it's mainly going to be used as food for pigs. So you can use it as a way to kind of get more in depth with your pig feed. Um, and then here, I don't think we have any, and I don't believe anyone else takes the CCM. Yep. So there you go. And let's see if they have any sell points on this map that take it. Because uh, the other option is you can also sell it. There's raw CCM. There's CCM right there. So 1100 bucks. That actually might be pretty worthwhile if you ferment it and get it over to that uh, since it's used as uh Pig food so there you go that might be a good way to go about it but essentially that is everything you need to know about corn cob mix if you have questions drop it down below in the comments again i probably did miss something it just is what it is i try to cover everything in as much detail as possible but it's always possible i missed something so um in general those are the easiest ways to go about it and again if you want to get it out of the silo here you just do it like you'd do anything else and pick anything else out of the silo uh but yeah so again that is how you do it right there. That is everything you need to know about CCM. If you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button up on your screen to join the Farmer Cop channel and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been Farmer Cop. Thank you guys for coming and watching.